cute girl hi guys and welcome back to my channel it's Vanessa here and I'm here to give you guys this non-traditional Valentine's Day tutorial but usually I know you guys see a lot of smoky eyes a lot of really red lips but sometimes you gotta like kick it up a notch and do something a little bit out of your comfort zone to have a popping Valentine's Day and that's what I have decided to do with you guys so if you're interested in seeing this look then go ahead and just keep watching and my single ladies out there happy Valentine's Day to you personally for me love you all so much and please give this video a big thumbs up so what I've already done is I've already put on my foundation my brows and we're just gonna jump right into the eyes so for this look, I'm going to start with my Huda Beauty palette and I'm going to go in with the shade Flamingo. I'm going to take this Coastal Sense blending brush. I want to go ahead and blend this into my transition area. Because this is a Valentine's Day, I want to keep it true, traditional, and just give myself a nice pink layer. Because what's Valentine's Day without pink? I'm gonna go back into the Huda Beauty palette and pick up Bay, which is this really pretty pale color, just to go ahead and blur everything out. I'm kind of blurring out some of that pink. This is my favorite blending brush. This is the MAC 224 brush, which is a bomb blender, especially for beginners. I think it's a great makeup brush. It's an investment. I'm going to go back into that same palette and I'm going to pick up Man Eater, which is this pretty burgundy and mossy. Using my 217 by MAC. I'm going to place this on my outer corner. Going back in with Flamingo just to blend it out. All right, I'm going to take this Urban Decay palette. This is the Beauty with an Edge palette. It's so pretty. It comes with a couple of shadows. I'm going to take this shade here called Fireball, which is this pretty, like, iridescent-y pink. I'm also going to go into Angelic from the Huda Beauty palette. Going back in with my 224 and just making sure all of that is nice and blended. Alright, we're going to come back to the lids because I want to go ahead and put on some lashes. These are the Coco Lashes in the style Adore. If you guys watched my last video, you know that these are my jams right now. I love these. When I got them, I was like so obsessed that I had to keep wearing them. Let's go ahead and work on the lower lash line. So I'm going to go back in with Flamingo and I'm going to place this along my lower lash line. Now that I have Flamingo, I'm going to go ahead and place Man Eater on my lower lash line as well. Alright, now that the eyes are done, let's go ahead and add some color to the skin. I'm going to use my Black Radiance Pressed Powder in the shade Cafe. This is a Elf Contour Angled Brush. For blush, I'm going to use my Elf Blush Palette. And I like to use this light color up here and a little bit of this only a pinch because light skin girls can go a little harsh on blush i have the artist couture diamond glow powder and this is the lebron i think i'm going to put some of this um lebron in my inner corner as well I love this highlight so much. I think I'm going to bring it on my lid. A mascara I've been loving lately is the Colossal Big Shot Mascara by Maybelline. So popular right now and really it's so worth it because it's so pretty. Charged water here. 
Of course, I'm going to use my Rosa Coffee Lip Pencil by Kiss New York. So I'm going to use Sweet and Sour by MAC. But of course, that's not always enough for me. I'm going to use my Mariah Carey Just Like Honey Lip Glass and top that right on top. For like a salmony, pinky nude. Be right back. And ladies, don't forget to take care of yourself on Valentine's Day. It's all about love, it's all about you. And don't let anybody tell you anything different. 